Spices, have you ever had one of those weeks where a cocktail sounds just like what the doctor ordered? So today we are making a mint julep, and a mint julep back in the day was actually made for medicinal purposes. Now, you don't really need an excuse to make a cocktail, but that's my excuse. And I got this recipe from my friend Kent Rogers, mostly outdoors. You have to go check out his channel. His link will be in the description box below. He's really awesome. Go subscribe to his channel. Tell him I sent you. So let's go spice things up. The first thing we are gonna do is cut off some mint that I have growing in my garden. All right, so now I am making some simple syrup, which is equal parts sugar and water. So it's one cup of sugar to one cup of water. Once you see bubbles start to form on the side, you want to stir your sugar and your water mixture right away so your sugar dissolves. We are not cooking this too long because we are not making a caramel. But once your sugar dissolves into the water, you have simple syrup just like this. So now I'm gonna just turn it off and then I'm just gonna keep it on the counter to let it cool down a little bit. In the meantime, I am just stuffing my jar with mint leaves. All right, so now that it has been sitting out for about 30 minutes to an hour, I'm going to just pour it right into this bottle. And it is perfect size. And since it's cooled down a little bit, then it shouldn't wilt your mint. And then I'm just gonna put the lid on. And then I'm gonna stick it in the fridge for about a day. All right, time to get started on our cocktail. Okay, so the first thing we are gonna do is get some ice and put it in a cocktail shaker. Now you don't have to, but I like to make sure it's nice and cold. And now you'll want two ounces of bourbon. I'm gonna put it right in here. And now we will want one ounce of the mint simple syrup you made. Put that right in. Put the lid on and shake. The key is to get this nice and cold. Now these cups I put in the freezer so that they would be nice and cold. And now I'm just going to get my little round ice cubes. And this I got from my husband for a present. Um, I will try to link it down below. Anyways, I don't like mine watered down, so I only just put one in the bottom. Pour it in. Now you wanna take mint, a nice, generous amount, a couple straws, put it right in the middle of the mint. And then lastly, a couple dashes of bitters. I like orange bitters in mine. Stir it up a little bit. All right, time to try this cocktail. And you wanna put your nose right in the mint as you're drinking it. It's all about the experience and the smells. Mm, the perfect cocktail to the perfect day. Thank you guys so much. And remember, if you'd like to see any more videos, click this link or this link. If you'd like to subscribe, click my face. And remember, I'm always here to help you make beautiful memories through food. Bye, and see you in the next video.